The Tale of Zeus, King of the Gods In the heart of ancient Greece, atop the towering heights of Mount Olympus, reigned the most powerful deity of all, Zeus, the King of the Gods. His presence was both awe-inspiring and terrifying, a majestic figure draped in flowing robes, adorned with golden armor that gleamed with an otherworldly light. The very air around him seemed to crackle with the energy of thunderstorms, a testament to his dominion over the skies and his role as the wielder of lightning. Zeus was not just a god. He was the embodiment of divine authority and justice. His piercing blue eyes could see through the veils of time and space, discerning the hearts and minds of mortals and immortals alike. His long, flowing beard and hair, as white as the clouds that swirled around his throne, added to his venerable appearance. Yet, despite his age, his body was that of a warrior in his prime, muscular and powerful, capable of feats of strength and endurance that no other could match. The Birth of a God The story of Zeus began in the depths of time, in an era where the Titans ruled the cosmos under the leadership of Cronus. Cronus, fearing a prophecy that one of his children would overthrow him, devoured each of his offspring as soon as they were born. But Rhea, Zeus's mother, could not bear to lose another child. She tricked Cronus by giving him a stone wrapped in swaddling clothes to swallow instead of her newborn son. Zeus was hidden away in a cave on the island of Crete, where he was raised by nymphs and fed by the divine goat, Amalthea. As Zeus grew, so did his strength and resolve. When he reached maturity, he sought out his destiny, determined to free his siblings and bring an end to Cronus's tyrannical reign. He confronted Cronus, and with the help of Metis, his first wife, forced him to regurgitate his swallowed children. Thus, Hestia, Demeter, Hera, Hades, and Poseidon were freed, and together with Zeus, they waged a ten-year war against the Titans, known as the Titanomachy. The Rise to Power The battle was fierce, but Zeus's leadership and unmatched power turned the tide in favor of the Olympians. With the Titans defeated and imprisoned in Tartarus, Zeus assumed his rightful place as the ruler of the cosmos. He divided the world among his siblings. Poseidon was given dominion over the seas, Hades the underworld, and Zeus the heavens and the earth. As the king of the gods, Zeus established his court on Mount Olympus, where he presided over divine matters and maintained the balance of the universe. Zeus's rule was characterized by his commitment to justice and order. He was known to be a fair yet formidable judge, often intervening in the affairs of mortals to uphold justice and punish those who defied the natural order. His weapon of choice, the thunderbolt, was both a symbol of his power and a tool of retribution. Crafted by the Cyclopes, these thunderbolts were the most potent force in the universe, capable of obliterating anything in their path. The God of Many Faces Despite his stern demeanor, Zeus was also known for his numerous romantic escapades. His insatiable desire for companionship led him to take many lovers, both mortal and divine. This aspect of his personality showcased his complexity, for he was not just a king but also a lover, father, and protector. Some of his most famous liaisons include Europa, whom he seduced in the form of a bull, Leda, with whom he lay in the guise of a swan, and Alcmene, who bore him Heracles, one of the greatest heroes of Greek mythology. These relationships often stirred conflict and jealousy, especially with his wife, Hera, the goddess of marriage and childbirth. Hera's wrath was legendary, and many tales speak of her relentless pursuit of Zeus's paramours and their offspring. Yet, despite the turbulence in their marriage, Zeus and Hera's union endured, symbolizing the complex interplay of love, power, and fidelity. Guardian of the Cosmos Zeus's influence extended far beyond the realms of love and war. He was the patron of hospitality, ensuring that guests were treated with respect and generosity. Violators of this sacred custom faced his severe punishment, as seen in the tale of Lycaon, who dared to serve human flesh to the god. Enraged by this atrocity, Zeus transformed Lycaon into a wolf and unleashed a flood to cleanse the earth of such abominations. As the god of fate and destiny, Zeus also held the threads of life, determining the rise and fall of mortals and nations. 
He was often depicted with the scales of justice, weighing the souls of men and deciding their fates. His oracles, the most famous being the Oracle of Dodona and the Oracle of Delphi, provided divine guidance to those seeking wisdom and insight into their futures. Protector of Humanity In addition to his roles as a judge and ruler, Zeus was deeply concerned with the well-being of humanity. He was often invoked by mortals seeking protection and justice. He was known to favor those who upheld truth and virtue, and many heroes and kings claimed his patronage. His interventions in mortal affairs were numerous and varied, from aiding heroes like Perseus and Heracles to punishing those who committed heinous crimes. Zeus's protective nature extended to ensuring the prosperity of the natural world. He controlled the weather, bringing rain to nourish the crops and ensuring bountiful harvests. However, he could also unleash devastating storms and droughts to chastise those who incurred his wrath. This dual aspect of benevolence and severity made him a deity to be revered and respected by all. Legacy of a Titan Zeus's legacy is one of strength, justice, and complexity. He was a god who embodied the full spectrum of human experience, from love and passion to wrath and vengeance. His tales have been passed down through generations, shaping the cultural and spiritual landscape of ancient Greece and beyond. As the king of the gods, Zeus's story is a testament to the enduring power of myth and the timeless quest for understanding the divine. In the end, Zeus remains a figure of awe and reverence, a deity whose presence is felt in the thunder that roars across the sky and the lightning that illuminates the darkest night. He is the guardian of order, the arbiter of justice, and the eternal ruler of the heavens. His tale is not just a story of a god but a reflection of the human condition, a mirror through which we see our own struggles, triumphs, and aspirations. And so, the legend of Zeus, the king of the gods, continues to inspire and captivate, a timeless saga of power, passion, and divine glory. Thank you for joining us on this journey through legend and lore. Subscribe for more mythical tales and epic legends.